Hello, I'm doing another uh, five minute game, so let's start. E4, C5, Knight F3, okay. Okay, Knight takes D4, Knight C6, okay, so let's play this, this, this line and with um, G3 that I like. Okay, this is not very uh, theoretical. I need to go back, of course. Two people sometimes they don't know what to do on this on this line. So just going out of the the theory. Okay, here what can I play? Nine, six. Okay, let's play here. Okay, knight b3, bishop g2. Okay. And then I have some tricks with this. Okay. I wanna play this. I'm not sure if it works here. Or I just castle. Maybe castling is first is better, right? Yeah, castling is better. Okay, he plays this thing. Yeah, so now now we see. Okay, bishop f4. Also if he plays e5, I play bishop uh, g4. Okay, but now he has some problems with um, with this dark square. Okay, for sure he has some problems. I can just try to exploit here. Okay, this dark square is gonna be like super important. Okay, so I can play this bishop, bishop retreat, and then going to b6. That's a possibility. Or playing bishop d6. So let's play bishop b3. Okay, he has to retrieve the queen of playing b6, but b6 looks like suspicious. So let's just get this squares. Okay, he's gonna give me his dark red bishop. Well, I'll take it. Okay, this is a uh, compensation. And then I have the plan of playing this b6. Okay, let me see what I play. Okay, what I play six. I'm gaining a temp, right? Thanks. Okay. Is he gonna give me the exchange? No. I'm playing. So he's he's the problem is he's um his uh, bishop is gonna be horrible the whole game. Okay. Now I can just take the okay, fine. So I just take this pawn. Yeah. I just take this pawn in h5. So gonna take here, okay I take I take and I'll have the option of playing bishop e4. Not sure if it works, but it's a possibility for sure. And he's being a bit careless here. Okay. Careless about the position. He's not seeing my my, my <laughs> he has like I don't know why he's moving and he doesn't like just see the possibility of uh of uh, development, right? He's just moving his pieces. So bishop b4. Mm, I can try just kicking the bishop. Okay. Or playing this move. Yeah, playing this move. If he plays knight b2. Okay, well. Yes. Yeah, I gained some tempos with uh, this, this guy, right? So let's centralize. I'll try to do something. Bishop 2. Yeah, let's just port my pawn and and have ideas of swinging the swinging the rook, okay? Which I have right now, okay? So this should be six. And I have the swing, rook swing, right? Rook swing. Mm -hmm. I have some tricks here. Again, last tricks, right? And I can swing the rook. So how is he gonna gonna defend this? I'm not sure. Okay, I have threatening mate, and he cannot stop it. Right, mate on h8. What is he gonna do? Okay, well he can stop it actually. Hmm. Okay. So let's play. Let's play this move. Okay. Seven. Mm hmm. See, I need an R piece. Seven. I need an R piece. 
Okay, if I play rook h6. Yeah. Let's try this. He has to do something quickly. Okay, check. I'm threatening mate. How is he gonna stop a mate? He can stop the mate. Yeah, he can stop the mate. G7. Yeah, that's uh that was an interesting game. Uh, so let's, let's just see what happened here, okay? So he's like he went for an attack on h5, which is kind of thematic, but his pieces and the queens are kind of uh, in the way of each other. So first he needs to untangle his pieces a bit, and his art for it will become a problem, okay? Right away. So I was planning of if he plays e5, I'm gonna play bishop uh, g5, and then taking control of the d5 square, okay? So uh, e5, bishop g5, I'm threatening to take on f6 and playing d5, okay? And knight d5. So that's a that's an idea. Okay, here he plays, and, and I have the option of pretty much gaining the dark square bishop, okay? And then his dark squares are too weak, too weak. And right now I can gain a pawn right away, okay? So he has this option. Hey, waste of the temple was this um. This c3. Well, no, not really. And then maybe taking on e6 was a possibility, but I wanted to. I wanted to do some more things here. Okay, I wanted to play bishop e4, and then if he plays f5, sacrificing on f5. That was my idea. He takes this, uh, accelerates my attack a bit. Right? So he plays this, and then I play this move. Right? Maybe rook. Um, Rook e8 was a possibility. Rook uh, g8. Okay, and he looks he looks more or less uh, okay. Yeah. Not that bad. It will be just a game. And we'll continue. Okay, nothing. And my actually my rook and f1 is out of the game. Okay, I still have an advantage here. But he actually yeah, rook g8 was the best move for sure. So what he did. Uh, he just, he just, uh, yeah, and I, I just went for this. Okay. So this is completely winning. Okay. Completely winning. So, thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.